Many people know that a job search requires more than scouring internet job boards and are aware that networking is also important. As many as 70 to 80% of job seekers are hired as a result of networking. So what is networking? Networking is the process of interacting with others to exchange ideas and knowledge, often between individuals who share a professional, academic, or social interest. Networking has many benefits, including gaining insight into an organization, building professional contacts, learning about unlisted positions, learning industry trends, refining your personal pitch, and finding mentors. For people who aren't naturally inclined to network, it can feel like an impossible challenge. But it doesn't have to be. First, consider who's already in your existing network. As the name suggests, these are people you already know, family, friends, classmates, neighbors, and coworkers. Comparatively, an expanded network might include contacts from professional associations, conferences, social media, the Violet Network, and LinkedIn, to name a few. Violet Network is an easy-to-use platform where NYU community members can engage in mentorship, networking, and professional development opportunities. It provides quick insights, more in-depth conversations, and allows you to connect with NYU students and alumni based on their industry, location, company, and other areas of interest. LinkedIn is also a powerful medium that's used to connect with others. In addition to searchable online jobs, it provides a great way to maintain professional connections and build new ones. It's also a place to build your professional brand by crafting a profile of your education, experiences, skills, and accomplishments. As with any other part of a job search, consider your audience and optimize your profile by including keywords and phrases that recruiters in your field would be likely to search. You might be wondering how LinkedIn and the Violet Network fit into your overall networking strategy. Keep in mind that the goal is not to have the most connections possible, but to build connections thoughtfully. Ideally, networking shouldn't just be something you think about when you're in an active job search, but rather something you do formally and informally all the time. Networking is dramatically different all over the world, so make sure that you are acting appropriately within the norms of that culture. In the US, it's important to remember that there is a line between proactive and aggressive. Asking a professional in your field to chat on the phone about their organization is proactive. Reaching out to a new contact to ask them to get you a job there is aggressive. When networking, consider the following best practices. Find out the best places for you to network. You might really enjoy the networking events at a small regional professional association, or you might prefer to have your existing contacts make introductions and then meet people individually for coffee chats. Prepare ahead of time. If you anticipate having a networking meeting with someone specific, find out more about their background and experience to help you prepare for thoughtful conversation. Don't dominate the conversation. Give the other person lots of opportunities to speak. Asking open-ended questions is a great way to do that. Follow up. A great conversation with no follow-up is a missed opportunity to build and sustain a relationship. Above all, be genuine and respectful in your interactions. Building meaningful, long-term relationships with other professionals can be incredibly helpful in the job search and beyond. For more information about networking, watch our video on advanced networking strategies. You can also speak to a Wasserman Center career coach or view our resources on Handshake.